this problem is about finding the equilibrium conversion versus temperature so let us read the problem statement determine the equilibrium conversion for the elementary reaction between elementary reaction between 0 and 100 degree celsius for the reaction a giving rise to r and r giving rise to a so we are given with the data at 298 kelvin the delta g value and delta hr that is nothing but the heat of reaction and additionally specific heat of feed and product are the same we are asked to find the plot of temperature against construction conversion additionally what restriction should be placed on a reactor operation if operation uh, if it is carried out isothermally for a conversion of 75 percent or higher so what are all needed uh, we need a plot of uh, xae versus temperature and we need to find the temperature corresponding to a minimum conversion of 75 percent okay so we know from uh, the thermodynamic relation that delta g equal to minus rt ln k so from which we can get the value of k at 298 kelvin because of the value of delta g at 298 kelvin and uh, here in, in this uh, uh, calculation we need to ensure that the units of this delta g and r are the same of course delta g is given in joule per mole uh, mole and r is also to be in joule per mole kelvin of course uh, it is to be ensured that temperature is always in kelvin because uh, this t or is uh, to be uh, from ideal gas uh, formula okay now uh, we have this k value at one temperature but what is asked is uh, as if uh, we need k as a function of temperature then only we can get equilibrium conversion for every temperature so for that before that we need no, uh, we have the formula the variation of equilibrium constant with heat of reaction in this problem it is given that the cp of products and reactants that is cp of a and b sorry b and a or a and b are the same so because of that we get the condition that heat of reaction at any temperature is also equal to heat of reaction at 298 kelvin so otherwise we need to use this formula heat of reaction at any temperature equal to heat of reaction at standard conditions and the mcp delta t or ncp delta t what is this delta t delta t is the reaction temperature and the standard temperature at which we have the data for heat of reaction now uh, now the problem is very simple because heat of reaction is a constant uh, and again equal to 298 uh, heat of reaction at 298 the data for that is already available now uh, so this integration is now very stay simple or is this delta gacha remains constant because of that we have this uh, nice equation uh, between k2 and k1 or is uh, k as a function of k2 or is if you want to find k at a temperature of t2 we can is, use this expression or is a sim in general we can write ln k by k1 equal to delta hr by r uh, 1 by t uh, minus 1 by t1 so k1 t1 data are known so we are going to get capital k as a function of temperature so we have this we are getting this expression and again this t has to be in kelvin so this expression is available now so we need to uh, connect this equilibrium constant with equilibrium conversion uh, of course we can write this uh, uh, reaction kinetics uh, is rate expression from rate expression uh, we can uh, is, uh, equate this rate to zero uh, or is this uh, uh, rate of forward uh, reaction and rate of uh, reverse reaction in terms of conversion ca equal to ca naught into 1 minus xa and r is cr naught plus uh, ca naught xa or is uh, uh, 1 mole of r will give you rise to 1 mole of uh, sorry 1 mole of a give rise to 1 mole of r so from which we have this so is cr is also equal to uh, C A naught into X A. Otherwise, 
sorry what is it c uh, we can write this cr equal to cr not plus the amount of r getting formed which is nothing but ca not xa now uh, now already it is given that we have pure uh, feed of pure a and there is no product in the feed uh, to start with so cr not equal to zero so yeah but uh, this equation is very simple now uh, now we have uh, we can equate this uh, dxa by dt to zero otherwise we want to find the equilibrium conversion so D, we are setting this dxa by dt equal to zero from which arise uh, and uh, at this condition xa is also equal to xa e equilibrium conversion so now we have uh, this equilibrium conversion related with k1 and k2 and we also know from thermodynamics k the equilibrium constant is nothing but uh, in this uh, case it is simply uh, cr at equilibrium and ca at equilibrium so this we can also write it terms of conversion so we have this capital k connecting equilibrium conversion this right this uh, equation and this equations are the same. always the right hand side of this one and the left hand side of this thing are same always capital k equal to k1 by k2 small k1 by k2 okay now okay now uh, having obtained the relation between equilibrium uh, constant and equilibrium conversion now our problem is solved otherwise we have we are given with a temperature range and for that temperature range we can get the values of capital k that is the equilibrium constant how do you get from the formula of the formula already we have obtained now capital k is available for every k we can get equilibrium conversion of course we can rearrange this equation to simply x a e equal to k by 1 plus k in that way the equation will be coming now x a e is available okay so using the data of x a e x a e as a function of temperature we can make this plot so this is a nice plot uh, what it gives it say, says that equilibrium conversion decreases with increase in temp temperature this is a characteristic of reversible exothermic so otherwise normally with increase in temperature conversion increases only for reversible exothermic with increase in temperature there is a decrease of conversion decrease of equilibrium conversion okay here okay so at what temperature it has to be operated so as to have a conversion of 75 percent or more that means we need to have a temperature less than that then only the conversion of course to get a conversion higher than 75 percent we need to be in this temperature range at least to minimum of 75 percent conversion we need to ensure that the temperature is not exceeding 350 kelvin okay Summar uh, to again quickly summarize so we were asked to find uh, make a plot of temperature versus conversion and also asked to find the maximum temperature of operation for a conversion of minimum of 75 percent so we are given with delta g delta h r data at standard conditions so using that we have obtained the value of k at one temperature additionally we want a function of the k to be uh, estimated at any temperature so we obtain this relation and this functional expression is available now we want to have a connection between this k and equilibrium conversion how they are connected so they are uh, connected by this uh, equation or is for that we can write this mm, which one uh, this from rate expression and equate that the equating the rate to zero from which we have the connection between equilibrium constant and equilibrium conversion otherwise equilibrium conversion can be obtained from the values of k at any temperature so that is plotted and we are getting the maximum temperature of operation from the plot that is corresponding to a conversion of 75 percent the operation temperature should be maximum of seven, uh, 350 kelvin if it if we operate at a temperature higher than 350 kelvin our conversion is limited okay thank you